All right, ladies and gentlemen, Fab's in the house, and welcome back to the channel. Today, yes, I'm here with these two beauties on the table. These are very, very rare and very, very expensive knives. But as usual, don't forget to like, subscribe, leave me a comment down below. Check out fablades.com and add fablades on Instagram. You see, that was easy. Also, another acknowledgement, huge thank to my buddy Guillaume for sending this thing right over here. It's something you don't really see that often. There's two only made of these Tihatium right over here. Watch out, don't cut yourself. And uh, there's 50 of these Hatti Magnetic uh, going on. So we have a custom division up here. We have uh, a full custom down here. We're gonna check out the similarities and the differences uh, between the two of them. So right ahead, uh, um, you know, we can check out the size, uh, the weight, whatever. Size is exactly the same. So this is the Thai Hatium and this is the Hati Magnetic. So historically, uh, Hati is the F95 with a carbon fiber G10 show side scale and the Thai Hatium is uh, like the full titanium version of the Hati. That's my interpretation. Uh, of course, uh, full custom and uh, uh, custom division, they have many, many differences and many, many similarities. The shape is the same, of course, blade shape and handle shape uh, and the clip as well. They're just matching, right? Uh, the differences are going to be a lot. So you see the milling, uh, the... Uh, this kind of milling, maybe it's hard to see with this slide, but I'm telling you, there's like this milling going on over here on this side. And here you have a little bit of difference. You see this break in, this interruption, which is like extremely difficult, by the way, to do. And you have it replicated on the back. So milling pattern for one. Obvious elephant in the room is the pivot. Uh, you get uh, a duck foot pivot for the full custom. Uh, these are four sides for both. Both are uh, keyed in and they are both accessible on the back. So here you just need a classic Shilogorov bit. Here you need like a custom bit, which is not uh, available to purchase. So you're gonna have to go through some other routes to obtain one of these and one of these to take these apart. Whereas here, you have the classic one. The, another difference is that the show side of the Taihatium is cleaner because there's no protruding uh, Chicago screw, let's say. Uh, in the Taihatium Magnetic, there's this beautiful solution, captive body screw, but it's going through and it's kind of like uh, not ruining the show side, but contributing to an interruption over here to the otherwise clean look at the bottom of the handle. So pretty much on the show side, this is what is going on. You check on the back of these two fellas and exactly the same thing is going on. Besides, this is carbo tie with magnesium dust particle infused into it and it's just titanium. So besides the fact that this is a different material, uh, things are going on the same, like same uh, shape for the backspacer, right? But uh, material, Tychron and titanium. So of course, fancy materials going on for the full custom indeed. Uh, turn on the back, you have a smaller screw for the custom uh, version. You have a, a dual tone finish clip with a different uh, kind of finish, which is pretty hard to, uh, pretty hard to see. I mean, it's kind of hard because of the fingerprints, but it's very, very different. Uh, just believe me. It is a, a different finish. Another little difference is that the uh, micro milling going on right over here on the right hat magnetic is missing on the full custom, so it's smoother. Here you have a dual tone finish, kind of like in this situation, but you have a, an extra layer of uh, uh, work you see in the actual pivot, which is kind of like 3D machine. Look at that. It's just like ridiculous. You have another little difference, of course, over here at the height of the internal uh, screw, which you see that is uh, thinner in the full custom and wider right over here in the, uh, in the uh, custom division uh, version. Everything else looks pretty much the same. You have a little bit of different chamfering going on and jimping tiny, tiny bit different for the flipper tab. But beside that, I really don't see much else. Let's just check these two blades. What is going on? So you have, of course, different steel. You have S90V for the custom division. You have 110V for the full custom. You have a hand rub finish. 
which is satin hand rub super fine finish and here you have the classic uh, stone fine stone wash classic division finish with polished flats uh, you have the same amount uh, of cutout for the blade a little bit shorter maybe on the full custom you have the same swedge going on so the ground is pretty much the same right a little bit different of course it's not perfectly identical uh, the flipper tab work is pretty much identical so not many different beside the finish and the steel going on for these two blades what you don't see is also another thing that is contributing to make another difference and it's the pivot system you have single row roller bearings for the custom division and you get double row roller bearings for the full custom which translates in superior lateral stability and definitely a different action and definitely a different uh, sound i hope you can appreciate this thwack compared to this thwack because they are different this is deeper this is higher pitched they're both gorgeous knives so they are both very expensive they are both very rare but as i said there's 50 of these and two of these made in russia of course this by a skilled team of workers more uh, workers more experienced in the shikogorov shop this only by sergey the man himself so another little test comparison i want to do is just the wait and see uh what is the difference it's not really that meaningful because i mean this is like a full taiwan and that is gonna be just of course carbon fiber blah 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 but in grams i want to know that this is 112.2 whereas the hattie magnetic is gonna be 94.7 which in uh ounces is three 34 and this is just like under 4 uh 3.96 so there you have the comparison between these two guys uh one full custom one custom division both are simply stunning so there you have it i really hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for watching and stay tuned